a truck carrying hazardous material overturned on I-10 in Tucson, Arizona, and nearby residents have been told to shelter in place. Now, obviously, every single time, like, hazardous spill ha spills out. Ooh, that looks really weird and scary. Never mind. Bro, I live downtown and we can smell it. It smells like ass. That's not good. Is it a road fire? No. The color of that chemical spill and the smell, if you're if you guys can smell it, I'm gonna be honest with you, that's definitely not good, man. Usually if you can smell something like that, um, the reason why you can smell it is because it's dangerous. Like some of these things don't have a scent. And they add it so that you know, so you can avoid it. You know what I mean? Oh, oh my God. Oh, yeah, this is so funny. Fuck, dude. Like, the whole purpose of the fucking weird scent is so that you can be like, oh, fuck, I'm smelling this. It's not good. We should just not be here anymore. Hazmat release I-10 between Kolb and Rita Road. Individuals within one mile radius should shelter in place. Those east of Houghton Road, west of Kolb Road, and north of Valencia and south of Voyager Rod should shelter in place. Turn off heaters, air conditioning units that bring in outside air. Travelers should avoid Interstate 10. I'm a truck driver that delivers hazmat loads. Typically have very specific routes that we have to take. Uh, uh, U.S. cities that we have to avoid in case of any sort of spell or accident. Guys, for people thinking like, oh, this shit's getting weird, by the way, it's not. It's not new. This is happening all the time. You're just paying more attention to it because of Ohio. Like, I'm not even kidding. When I, I don't know why people like refuse to recognize that. Apparently it's nitric acid. Oh boy. I-10 closed near South Cove. People warned the shelter in place due to nitric acid spill. According to Arizona Department of Public Safety, the closure is due to a hazmat spill related to the crash. Tucson fires on scene. Authorities say it will be an extensive closure. Drivers should find alternative routes to avoid the closure and related delays. Exposure to nitric acid can cause irritation to the eye, skin, and mucous membrane. It can also cause delayed pulmonary edema. Pneumonitis, bronchitis, and dental erosion. Nitric acid is highly corrosive. Workers may be harmed from exposure to nitric acid. Listen, to the chatters who are wondering if you're living in Tucson, Arizona, near the spill, uh, fear not. You know, you got a $5 coming your way. You got a whole five-ass dollars, dude. So get excited for that. Think about what you can buy with that. Maybe a fucking Hasanabi subscription. I'm just saying.